Our Monica Coleman is in Truckee. She was at the press conference uh, where we just heard from multiple law enforcement agencies regarding uh, finding the vehicle, the Rodney family vehicle, uh, which uh, we heard from the Nevada County people uh, most likely uh, had the uh, victim Ky uh, Kylie Rodney in it. All right, let's take it to Monica Coleman. Monica, I think you were going to, we both were kind of struck by this, Adventures with Purpose, the dive team, that found the vehicle, much like perhaps Sacramento's DART team, volunteer divers. How were, they must be really, really good at what they do because they found this car, uh, whereas other uh, options like the sonar from law enforcement didn't find it. Speak to that. Yeah, that's the biggest question that was um, taken out of this press conference today. How was Avengers with Purpose able to find this car 14 feet deep into the water, but officials for the last 16 days were not able to? We asked that question. We brought it straight to CHP and Truckee officials, and they say that they looked in the exact place that Avengers with Purpose, this volunteer organization group, looked, and they could not find the car. They claim that it may be due to Mother Nature. As the water levels go up and down, they did say that they did look in that exact place, but were not able to find the car that they alleged that Kylie was driving that evening. But um, eventually with purpose, the organization that claimed they found the car and the body inside said that they used high tech technology. Take a listen to what they said earlier today in their own press conference. We placed two sonar boats in the water. By 1115 AM, Nick detected an object underwater using cutting edge Garmin sonar technology. Another big takeaway was that they claimed they reached out to the family of Kylie Rodney. But when we asked, we tried to ask the family, they did not say whether or not that was true. We asked law enforcement whether or not Avengers of Purpose reached out to them when they found out that they had seen this car pulled out of the water and claiming that it was Kylie inside that car. But law enforcement says they did not get a call initially from Avengers of Purpose. They had to call them, but they are claiming they were working in partnership with the organization. So way more questions and answers came out of this press conference today. Well, hey, that is Monica Coleman. She's in Truckee. Uh, again, it's been a difficult search. Uh, hundreds of people involved in this 15,000 man hours. Uh, and, 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 and fortunately, at this time, after all this time, the vehicle was located with a body in it, which they believe to be Kylie Rodney, who's been missing for 16 days. So, uh, you know, it, it's likely that it, it wouldn't, the fact that the sonar didn't detect the, uh, the car uh, wouldn't have saved her life, but it does raise the question of how effective that sonar will be going forward uh, if you can't find a car in 14 feet of water.